Hey, Amber. Hi, how are you? I'm great. How are you? I'm good, good. Good. Um, so I'm ready whenever you are. Um, so everyone remembers you as Vicki, um, Captain Stubing's daughter on the love boat. How old were you when you started the show, and how did you um, become a part of the cast? It was a, a very sort of fortuitous experience. Uh, I was 11 when I started, and I was doing another series for the show's producer, Aaron Spelling. And when that series was in its pilot season, um, I did Love Boat as a guest star. And I went back to my series, and my series wasn't picked up. And Aaron called me, and he asked me to come back and be on the Love Boat for real. And so I did. Oh, nice. That's yeah. awesome. Yeah, it was great. Uh, sorry. Um, That's okay. How did your castmates treat you? Oh, I, you did know, you, we were... You, sorry, did you have any particular, like, fond memories of, like, you and the cast? Uh, great memories with the cast and myself. They were, first of all, most of them were parents, so they understood what it meant to have a child on the set, and they were very protective. Uh, I learned my sense of humor from them. They, uh, each and every one of them has a wicked sense of humor. So there was a lot of laughing on the set, probably a lot of very inappropriate jokes at the time, but uh, I'm still here, I'm still breathing. I, I <laughs> it's been a great experience. We are all still the dearest of friends. And Aww. yeah, I mean, we're, we're, I'm actually, I just wrote a pilot, uh, with my writing partner and Ted Lange, who played Isaac the bartender, is directing it. So mm, that's awesome. Yeah, yeah. So that's we're all very awesome. close. You spent a large time, um, large portion of your childhood aboard a princess cruise ship. Uh, did you enjoy your time on board? I obviously enjoyed my time on board because <laughs> I, I'm still with Princess and grateful every day when I wake up that I am. I'm the celebrations ambassador for Princess Cruises, uh, which is actually why I'm here talking to you. And it's so cool because it's plan a cruise month right now in October. So actually, if you go to our website, princess.com, we have amazing deals through November 16th. Get on board, book a cruise, you'll love it. That's awesome. Yeah. Um, what is plan a cruise month all about? But, um... Plan a cruise month is actually a great opportunity for us to get the word out about how fun it is to take a cruise. Uh, and I can speak from my own experience. I've got two kids, one of them is 21, and one of them is 11. And to find a vacation that where I can satisfy both of their desires and dreams is really hard to do with that wide of an age range. But cruising is really the only way I know how to do that that's affordable. And you can take a cruise. We just took a cruise to the Mediterranean. We went to seven countries. And in those seven countries, we only unpacked and packed once and we only got on a plane and got off a plane once. And oh, that's every, amazing. Yeah, every day we woke up, we were in a different country. Every day we woke up, we got to have a different country's food. So my kids got to have, my, my, my little one was very excited to have French fries in France. Uh, <laughs> my older one was very excited to be in Tuscany having his first glass of red wine. So these are That's awesome. Yeah, I mean it's really, really incredible. We got to go. We were in Provence and we got to shop through a French farmers market with the guy with the accordion playing. I cannot tell you how picturesque it was. It was the quintessential oh, that, moment. That sounds awesome. That sounds so gorgeous. It really, it really, really was. <laughs> it really was. I, I'm almost embarrassed about what an amazing time I get to have all the time with Princess Cruises. That's awesome. Yeah. What do you think, um, or why do you think cruises are a nice way to celebrate like a special occasion? Well, as the celebrations ambassador, I will tell you that I will take any moment to celebrate. We all know the typical ones, right? We've got the birthdays, the anniversaries, the graduations, the weddings, things like that. But as I say all the time, we're in such a, a, a a different time globally and there are so many things that can you know maybe be hard for us to think of um, find joy in the world but it's important to do that and so 
think of the little things in your life that you have to celebrate. Did you, did you have a significant weight loss? Did your kid achieve something great in school? Is this the time that you really need to rebond with that friend of yours that lives across the country? Meet up on a cruise and, and, and share and experience new things together. There's just, every day my kids wake up and I say, let's think of three things that we're grateful for. And they can't be the same every day because I want to kind of reboot them every morning to, to think about what blessings they have in their life. And, and when you do, you'll find there are so many things to be grateful for and in turn, so many things to celebrate. And honestly, I don't know another cruise line who does it as well as Princess does. So if you go to the website, you'll see we have a whole section that's just dedicated to celebrating. So go there, check it out, get a great deal right now through November 16th, plan a cruise, have the trip of a lifetime and come back new. That's awesome. Well, I do appreciate you talking to us. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Amber. It was great to talk to it, you as well. It was great talking to you too. Thank you. All righty. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.